Hi, I'm Martina and today I want to show you how you can sow a lot of vegetable and flower seeds outside on a day like this. I will be using this plastic box as a mini greenhouse, which is a great way if you have no greenhouse or a small greenhouse or no space indoors for your seedlings. But the best thing about it is that you end up with much better plants than if you sow them indoors. They already used to the cold temperatures changing and the light levels. You want to choose a see-through box like this so the light can come in and you need to drill air holes. Some people put it in their lid but I don't recommend that because when it rains a lot of water will get in even through the tiny holes and that's not good. Some people put it at the bottom. I don't do that either because I want to be able to put water in the box and the trays that I use soak up the water from underneath. So what I do is I put them on the side over here and you have to remember that very little moisture will escape this box once the lid is on so you don't want any water to come in from underneath or the top. I will be using these plastic trays. I like to reuse plastic trays like this that you get from the supermarket with fruit or I even reuse meat ones to make sure I wash them properly and then make little holes in the bottom. These ones already have the holes. I will fill them up with my own seed compost. If you want to find out how you can create your own seed compost, we have another video on that. Far from all seeds are suitable for this kind of sowing. I will be sowing two types of cabbages and one broccoli today. Other seeds that are okay for this is chive, lettuce, spinach, parsley, all types of brassicas like cabbage, broccoli, kale and swedes, turnips, spring onions and pak choy. It's also great for some annual flowers like cosmos and cornflower. I will put a bit of compost on top, press it down slightly and also don't forget to label what you have sown. I will now put my trays in the box. And I haven't watered these because the soil is slightly moist and I'm lucky enough to have snow here today. So I will put a little layer of snow on top and when it gets warm enough in the box that will melt and automatically water my seeds. I then pop the lid back on and I take the box and I put it somewhere shaded or at least partial shade. You really don't want to put this in full sun because even though it's freezing outside when it's sunny, it gets really hot in here. And the whole idea with this is that the seeds should germinate when the time is right. So you don't want it to get super hot in here and they germinate too early because then you're gonna end up with plants that you need to prick out and pot on and put somewhere sheltered. So I put it in the shade. I hope that they germinate just at the right time and then when they're big enough I can plant them straight out. I hope you have enjoyed this video, it really is a great way of sowing and you end up with fantastic plants. If you want to find out more about Corker who have sponsored this video go to corker.co.uk and if you want to follow me you find me on Instagram at simplygrowfood and on YouTube, Simply Grow Food.